was a um, great college basketball game. That was the one that our place was. Obviously, it was more dominated by offense. And in the games we've been playing, VCU, traditionally, we've kind of handled the pressure fairly well, but not scored in the half court. I thought tonight we did both. Of course, we didn't defend them very well. Um, Of course, we didn't defend them very well uh, in the half court either. And, uh, you know, some of the guys made, you know, some of the really good players made really good plays. And uh, I couldn't be prouder of my team if we had won. And uh, you know, this is what college basketball is all about. A great rivalry, two really good teams. Um, and a game, you know, that, that is uh, just at such a high level. Other than having three great guards, what's, what's the secret yeah. to beating the, the press? Well, I mean, you know, th having three great guards is really important. You know, Greg Robbins, um, I don't want to say we didn't have any trouble, but Greg Robbins does a really good job at kind of, you know, setting us. He, he inbounds. You know, the most important part is the inbound. If you can get that pass inbound without too much trouble, then you can, it's easier to make the next pass. So if you can do those things, that, that, that really helps. I think, so I give a lot of credit to Greg. We also have our front court players. Who, we recruit players who can handle the ball. You know, uh, Terry Allen got in a couple of situations. He dribbled out of trouble. Derek Williams got in a couple of situations. He caught the ball to get us out of trouble, dribbled out of trouble. So I, I think probably mo more of that. Now you have to be tough, especially when it's on the road. Um, you know, but I, I think it's as much as just how we try to attack the game uh, that we're able to, you know, I'll say, handle the pressure better than other teams. Um, yeah, well, they, they, you know, again, we, we didn't stop them consistently enough. I thought Graham was great. Uh, I, I think Theus is a great, great player. Uh, we, we didn't stop them, and I, I thought, you know, we when we had our opportunities, we didn't we didn't kind of take care of it. You know, we were impatient maybe on one or two. Uh, but but it, it's hard to kind of point the assign any blame to guys who played so well during the course of the game. So. Uh, I, I can't. I wouldn't be able to put my finger on it right now. I know they. I know they were great, you know, uh, kind of in in their half court offense, the whole second half really, but especially down the stretch. There seemed to be an inordinate number of N ones in this game that were just really tough shots. It looked like. Yeah. Uh, for which team? <laughs> <laughs> I sat pretty close to you, so I kind of yeah. know where you come from. No, I, I, I will say this. Uh, you know, I, I, I think uh, I just have far too much respect for VCU to, to, to comment on that. I think they, they played great, and, you know, their defense is great, and tonight their offense was great as well. Chris, thoughts on having this rivalry in conference? I think it's great. Uh, you know, like I said, this is college basketball. We played them at our place on a Thursday night. This is a Wednesday night. Couldn't have been two better atmospheres than we've played in. Uh, the, the crowd's into it. There's more talk about it, you know. Uh, you know, and, and uh, from a from a fan standpoint, a, a city of Richmond fan standpoint, I hope we play again in Brooklyn. You know, I I think it's tremendous. Um, I, I love having them in our league, and I, I think they're going to do great. And um, but I, I think it's great. The more opportunities we get to play, I think you can see just see how high the level of the game, how high a level of game it was. You know, it's hard to say. Um, I wouldn't have predicted what happened two years ago, so it would it would be hard to say. I think, you know, again, it comes down to their players, and Theus is as good as any point guard. Uh, Redick is a great player. Graham is a great player. Um, Daniels is a great shooter. So they they have they have plenty of pieces. I I, I wouldn't I wouldn't know what to say, but I, I know they can win games. Yes. A little bit, you know, a little bit. The one time he kind of got slipped up on defense in the second half. Uh, but I thought he was tough. He turned it early, got taped up, came out and played the rest of the game. Um, you know, he's a tough kid, and, and I thought that was on display tonight. Big shots and some of the freshmen have some No doubt about it. I, I really I love our freshman class. And uh, at this point, they have enough experience that they're really ready to help. Even in a game like this, it's a hard game. You're being asked to do a lot. You know, VCU runs a lot of sets on offense, as well as the pressure, as well as the rebounding. So they're being asked to do a lot, and they, they answered. And 
I'm really high on, on this class. I think they're going to be, you know, they're going to continue to produce and, and win a lot of games. Well, I'm thrilled. I, I think if you saw Greg today, how many different little things he did for us, and Darian, of course, being such a great player over the years, uh, you know, th those guys have given a lot to the program. They, they have been, uh, there's an old saying, you be a fountain or a drain, you know, and they have been fountains. They've given and given and given uh, and, and haven't asked for anything. I mean, they have given to the program in a way that uh, their parents and the coaches and our, our fans can be proud. Anything else? Thanks, guys. Have a good night.